you guys, thanks for joining us today. Mike here at Weeby Autos. Today we have a really special car, 1987 Mazda RX-7. Uh, it's been converted to a V8. It's got a big monster 383 stroker in it. I got the owner here, he's gonna tell us a little bit about it. How are we doing today? I'm doing just fine, how are you doing today? Man, what a sleeper, bro. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice car. Jeez. It's got a, a 383 stroker in it. Mm -hmm. It's got a, aluminum heads on it. 850 Holly <clears throat> four barrel. Wow. Headers, it's aluminum headers. radiator. It's got stainless steel exhaust all the way through it. Wow. It's got aluminum radiator. Nice it's lumpy just, cam. It's just a... It's a monster. A nice little street car <laughs> where, uh, you know, nobody would expect it. No, not at all. Not till you hear it. No. Nice yeah. solid body. I didn't see any rust anywhere. No, there's no rust. None whatsoever. You don't really see them anymore with like uh, an 87 with no, no and rust. That's a, and that's a turbo body. Yep. Now I was told, I don't know how true it is, but that's, you know, the turbo bodies in that year is getting rare. Very rare. So, you know. No, because they all been tuned to death and just raced to death uh, and rusted to death. It's a nice car. It's clean. It is really you unique. Know? Nice, super you know, straight turbo, body. Right. It has a turbo 350 training in it with the oh. reverse manual shift. Okay. So it's uh, a it, manual it, valve body in it? Yes. Cool. And it's got a trans brake on it. Wow. You know, it, uh, I, it's not hooked up, mm -hmm. but it's all hooked up. The nitrous bottle is 125 shot. Cool. Uh, all the lines right there, the guy, just, I just never got around to hooking it up. So with but the setup the way it is, with the stroker, it's probably a little four and a quarter horse, I would guess. Well, the guy told you me think? I got it from him, putting like 480 horse to the wheels. 480 to the wheel? Yes. <laughs> and then you got the one. 125. <laughs> so, you know, that's bringing it up there. It is. It's a little over you know. 500 to the wheel with the shot. Sure. Wow. Definitely. Definitely sounds of it, too. Again, man, look at this body, super straight. Yes. Beautiful. Man, must turn some heads down the highway. Very original inside, original buckets. It's got a little over 75,000 miles on it. Real nice door panels. Full gauge, so you got air fuel ratio, fuel pressure. You got your uh, water, temp, oil, and uh, RPM there. Pretty cool, man. And there's a stereo system in the glove box. And a stereo system in the glove. Does everything work on it? Like the moonroof and the... the... windows work. The moonroof is that's not hooked up. Okay. You know, we, they took some wires and used it for other stuff inside the car. Okay. Cool, man. Love it. I never seen one of these with the V8 conversion. Me neither. I was looking at the BMWs last night with V8 conversions. Right, right. The E30s and E34s. Pretty cool. This car is way lighter than that. Let's pop the hood. Check it out. Blam. Fits nicely in there. Yes. Well, as you can see, the MSD in the back. Yeah, MSD. Everything's all new. All back there. You got your blaster coil. Yep. Looks like uh, oil return up there. There's your fuel pump. Yep. Aluminum radiator, electric fan. Like I say, everything underneath the hoodie is all new. Trans cooler. Pretty cool, man. Looks like uh, that might be an Edelbrock Performer up top. Aluminum heads. Headers, MSD uh, wires. There's your nitrous setup. That's a big carburetor too, man. 850, yeah. huh? 850. Jeez, sick. All right, let's fire it up. Sounds evil.
Nice and lumpy. Yeah. The lumpier the better. <laughs> it's kind of happy. <laughs> Real happy. You just need some drag radials back there. Yeah. Did you hook up at all with those tires? Probably not, right? No, you just can. You need some uh, Mickey Thompson or drag or radials or those Nitto 555R, something yep. like that. It'll hook it up. Man. Wow, pretty sick. Sounds nice. Wow, pretty awesome. That's a stainless steel exhaust on there, right? Yes. All the way back? Yeah, stainless steel all the way, uh, from the center of the car back. Cool. Wow. Well guys, thank you so much for joining us today. Again, my name is Mike from Weeby Autos. Feel free to give us a buzz. We're at 631-339-0399. You can also check out more pictures, information, and detail on our main website. It's WeebyAutos.com. And uh, hope to hear from you soon. Thanks a lot.